What you may be asking yourself is, what is a bean tree? Well, in this case, it's a tree-shaped structure designed for pole bean vines to run up and down. So I call it a bean tree. Thought I'd work on my bean patch here a little bit today. First, we'll pick up some of my mess. All right, let's make a hole in the ground. Bye. 
All right, my friends, I got my post hole dug with these old beat up post hole diggers. About two and a half feet deep. The ground's getting kind of hard down there. Hopefully that's deep enough. The question is, how do you put a post in the hole with a cage around it and then keep the cage up out of your way while you pack dirt around the hose? I think I got enough here to solve that problem. I should be able to drag the cage up out of the way. Now let's put this post in the hole. Oh. Well, this is in the hole. I don't know if it's deep enough or not. Doesn't have to be that strong a pose. All it's going to hold up is some bean vines. Should have put two lines on that top. That's okay, we can bring the ladder out here and do that. It's not a big deal.
Well, for better or worse, that's close to what it's going to look like. Once I get some ropes on there, that's going to be my bean tree. Well, I didn't get a lot done today. I'm tired. We went and paid taxes this morning. I turned all this dirt again. Mixed in some potash or wood ash. It's been rained on, but it still had plenty of ash. This is basically what my bean tree is going to look like. I'm going to plant beans all the way, away, all the way around this cage, probably inside and out. And I'll come out here with my ladder and string these ropes up and down various places. Should have put them on the pole before I stood it up. It's not a rope, it's some kind of plastic clothesline that was under the workbench. I suspect that's exactly what it was for, clothesline. It's got wire in the middle of it though. That's going to be my runners for my beans to grow on after they reach the top of here. If they don't grow, or the ones I got in the freezer, we'll still go buy some more and plant them. We'll give these a couple weeks to see if they sprout as soon as I get them in the ground. It won't be today. Maybe tomorrow I'll put them in the ground. So today I'm just giving you a look at my bean tree. Have you created a bean tree lately? I have. Walter's bean patch. Walter's bean tree out in the bean patch. I think you all be surprised at how many beans I can pick off of those few little lines that go around there. And we'll get a couple of good messes out of it. Let's go to the house, y'all.